mean? Like a little telekinesis here and a sinister gaze over there. So maybe it helps the Ooh. pango sort of control the fight. It happens. Oh, oh God, this always nightmares feels about this. so bad. You're just oh, walking away, wanting something to do, but it's it all the way around. Well, he's losing creep after creep as it goes. <laughs> yeah, you're right. They're, they're falling. It's like breadcrumbs in the jungle. Funnick, in the meantime, ends up dying. And guess what? Because the waves met back together, they TP away. Yeah, that's a, honestly, that's what I checked. I was like, did he misclick stats? Up top. <laughs> going on him. About him, there's also a battle happening. They are running away on Ari, but Rubik, he's not going to be so lucky. It's chased down by White Mon. Too good, not dying to help refill him as the pounce doesn't connect, but there's a charge through. Ari will take the double damage on the both, but he's very low. Ari, oh, yeah. you're crazy. Oh, yeah, snatch. that's that'll happen. Maybe not. It's 0.7 instead of one. Quick. Yeah, but it's on all three. Right. Uh. Wait, what the Chasing. Sane. Couple more hits. Uh. Yep, he's done. It's worth it. No, blast off the other way. Okay. He's, 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 he's a what dead he guy. Now, he just needs Ari to use the vision to charge over there and then steal it. But he looks serious. Going to get the XP for it, but no. He's not quite the lowest that time. Um, okay. Stealing the sacks. That's pretty nice for him. Jump in from White Mon. Oh, that hurts. That was so nice for them. But nice. the stun, chase, and kill. So it costs them something to do. White Mon checking uh, but the yeah. stacks. Sees they're gone. Charge coming through. Lift in the midst of it. Has Chain Frost ready. Throws it out. Good damage. Bounce back and forth from Dendi. Ari, he is going to get ran down and killed. Once they can chase down White Mon. Good Tumblr's toy to get up to the high ground. Drops down a couple of mines. Gets hit by it on the other side. Has the Chakram for the chase. Fade Bolt too. Pulls it back in. The damage comes out, but Dendi with the swash, it's enough to finish. It will be in trouble oh, now on push. the Rubik. The Chakram on Chakram tries to get out, but won't be able to. Yeah. Den All right. Gonna pull the wave. Dendi chasing a bit. Doesn't have Diffusal quite yet. They have the lift and the pull in Ari. Well, he is mega dead. They go for more. Have to cancel that TP in. Not really at all. White Mon. Uh all right, he's uh, crazy. Stun onto two, backs two, away, two one mine killed. Throws out the blood grenade. Lodine gets the pull back onto Bryal, lives through it. White Mon dead. Dendi needs to be careful here, though. Damage coming out. Is that to take off some of these debuffs if the time comes around? Jump in, tries to get out, and able to dodge it. Gets out of trouble, and look at this turnaround. Oh man, that illusion rune so clutch, keeping him alive. Ari in trouble, gets sniped by Funic. Again, this is before Pipe comes out, so this is still oh a window God. that Bait have to be playing kind of aggressively, I feel like. Move in so damage. with the Rubik, go for Bryo, but the charge comes through. Now back wall onto three. Follow up, not really there. Turn it with the mech. Stun now from White Mon, reactive taser onto several. Stonebake tries to back away. The techie's damage starting to rack up slightly as the first glimpse of that Terra Blade throws out a reflection. And now a Metamorphosis run down onto the Rubik, gonna find the kill. The Slom is not strong enough. Stonebake is gonna go in with the ulti already used, but has to jump away. And the Surge Terra Blade with an Iron Shell. Tell me you don't see this in your nightmares, and I won't believe you. Sunders to the side, finds another kill, triple for Bryle. As Tomato, he just shows up to fights and wins them. That's all he needs to do on the carry. Still bang. Oh, it's going on Dendi now, this raid. Takes it. Already has his own save and wants to keep fighting anyway, so. If he dies, and his revive's not going to be that great anyway. But they're in there, pressure with Aegis, and they got Ari. He is gone. Look at that fast kill. Into the area where they're at. They're pinging exactly oh. where he is. This is huge. If they can find the real one, Roar is out. The drums, full bore. And they also have the Chain Frost. Oh, they got, they didn't get it out in time before the, the Spire. And he gets the Sunder off because of it. Oh, disaster. Disaster. Tomato turns. They had the damage, but a little mix up. 
Stonebank now tries to get out. They all have to evacuate. Oh, that hurts. As Dendi <laughs> is going to die. Lodin falls next, and it all goes so tragically. We're going to have to see a replay of that. You actually are seeing even more things come out right now. So Darks here fully committed as they find Ari and are going to be able to find a pickoff, it looks like. Uh, to the max out, like, survival. I was rich. Look at those people gifts. Disgusting. Three people's gifts, three van braces. Back. Connection. Dendi. Thondo. Is he going to get away? Oh, the answer, that one is a no. I think. Yeah. Maybe just a little bit, yeah. All right, well, better than neutral items is the Aghanim Scepter here for Stonebag. So way more control of these team fights. Ability to chase. Oh, Ryle. he's just isolated enough that they thought they could do something. It's a bait. Back wall pulls back. Chain Frost, that's a good one. That's a great one, in fact, doing oh, some hold, insane hold. damage. Stonebank now turns onto Tomato, ready to keep building up these stacks. He's drumming through it all on Funic. The leash is going to be there. The turn Chakra double down on it. Tomato pops the BKB, saves the Sunder. Not at all afraid of anything that could have gone wrong there. The turn, the chase, and White Mod, he's gone. I mean, I never thought that was going to go poorly for bait. I've seen that story a hundred times. The timber looks tasty and inviting, and then you, you obviously just oh. get turned on, but nice plays. And now again, another catch out of mana here. And out of life on that Darks here. Nice. Uh, that's kind of crazy. Oh, I mean, oh, the, the scan. They found Tomato going. Yeah. Hawk sees him. They're right on him. This Double would be jump. enormous. Tries to go. Oh, doesn't quite have the vision, though. They need the dust. And now they find the Rubik. Four staff jump Whoa, away, saves. but they're able to get there in time for the barrier. Ari turned upon now. Stonebake building back up that Agi. 50, 51. Keep counting. How high can you go? They're looking for more. Stonebake knows he's strong, but can he be strong enough to survive through oh, all of this? He's isolated. Doesn't have his ulti. Backs away. Funic jumps Teammates. back too. They couldn't get they past the tier two tower. They still have Surge. They're waiting. They're ready to go back in again. If you're Bryo, you have to be careful here. Yeah. And some, of course, yeah, waiting to Surge someone to also try and find that next big steal. Can't go through the gate. Man, I feel like Bait did so many things right there where they pressure the tier two and they immediately uh, like sweep over the Ancients. They hit the scan on it and now they just lose this Roche. Oh, that's got to be so annoying. Dark Pack off. You should be fine. Yeah, but he's got Dark Pack lost stuff. You know, those techies, they're, they're pretty crafty. Ooh, he's just... Surge is actually better because Rubik has the shard. This is going to run away now and not have it online anymore. No, oh, there he goes. Stone Bay. Jump through. Found the backline tech. He's leashed up for the moment. Already down to super low HP. As Tomato came out with that silver, it started beating into him. Stone Bay, he's in trouble. Has oh, to jump nice away. Jump. Nice but control. On to Bryle. Got him dead. Tomato still hanging onto his BKB, onto his cheese, onto everything. Dendi. Dondo. Backs away. Tries to jump. Can't get out of there. Easy bring down for Bryle. And, uh, on Darks here. It looks like maybe that's what they were waiting for. Uh, as they're going to head on up and be ready to fight. Or maybe they're just waiting for bait to leave their base. Don't bank. Out of it. Chase. Temper chain through. Dendi. Roach has just spawned. So to the victor go the spoils. Looking for him. Can they find anybody? The time Rubik, bomb. Very far away. Darkseer trying to buy a little bit of extra space. White Mon over to the side. Backs out. Stone Bank gets jumped on. Gets the ulti off. Pops BKB. Turns on to Ari. Starts to bring him down. Funny. Up on the high ground. They jump through for Dendi. Just gets obliterated. But they Stone do Bank's have trying. Tomato living through all of this. Does not even care a little bit. As they kill off the Pango. And thus ends the fight. Good to get a free 6,000 gold, you know? Yeah, yeah. But the way that they've been fighting is like Terrorblade rock chains around. And with the old team now down, Tomato feels confident just keeping these illusions sent in. Funic moves forward. Does not decide to go for the roar there onto Tomato. 22 seconds until Refresher is back up again as Bryle spams the Chakra consistently onto them. Jump, Roar, finds it immediately onto Bryle. Tomato, Demon Zeal backs away. Stone Bank can't really hit into him that much harder. Has to jump out. 
So a whole lot of kerfuffle for not a whole lot of killing. You know what they say, Trent. I do. And they have a scythe right now, so he's being a little bit careful here. Cross the charge. It. Interrupts. Leash now onto Darkseer. Not much mana. Backs away. Chain Frost down, but they get the kill. Oh, and now crash. the bash. He's Stone isolated. Bake. Been building up a lot of these Jazzy stacks for a while. And they find more. Tomato. Although Tomato. Ready to come back in, large and in charge. Can he kill them all off? He's doing a couple of misses up on high ground. Does take down Lodi, but still Stone Bank surviving through this. Just barely not enough though in the end. And thus go the Essence Shift stacks. Can they catch them on the retreat though? Everybody buys back on the side of Bait. Tomato gets the Hurricane Pike pushback with a jump forward Funic on top of them. Oh, the Manta, he couldn't get the roar off. Oh, the Manta to dodge it. And Ouch. just like that, that is going to be Rax. No Dendi, no Funic. TSM taking buildings. I mean, Tomato was looking kind of vulnerable there, and then he just pops out a cheese. He's now got a second cheese that he's going to put in here, which he can use again in 20 seconds. Uh, pops the refresher, and it's just, yeah, he's back, baby, you know? Unstoppable Demon Zeal as well. He's able to rip that out whenever he wants. Really nice. They're trying to find their moment here. They still have stolen Chakram. They have the Lich ulti. It's only Rider. level two, though. Is he's level 17. Rebuild these stacks if possible. But Stonegate, he gets ruptured. Or not ruptured, excuse me. He gets Sundered. Reflection stolen. That actually might be one of the best things they could do in this. Let's try and... Wait, was that Reflection or is that was Conjure Image? Never mind. That's not so good. Uh, That's not Frost. as good. No, no. <laughs> Jay Frost bouncing back wall, back on to three. And the jump in from Techies put in a period and an exclamation point on this victory. As Stonebank, he's in trouble. He gets brought down, gets killed. And TSM, they are going to take this series 2-0. What an impressive showing. GG called. Yeah, it's uh, it's tough for bait. It uh, kind of reminds me of the series this morning versus Liquid, where it's just a situation where you're coming in because uh, that was uh, the other. Who was that? Oh.